Hello friends, this is Miss Jennifer back again for another craft time with the Rappahannock Area Community Services Board Prevention Services. Today we're going to make pinwheels. I'll show you what you need for this craft. You're going to need a square piece of construction paper. You're going to need a pencil. You're going to need a thumbtack. And you're going to need a pair of scissors. You're going to need a pesky cat. <laughs> so, with, I'm going to flip the camera down so you guys can see what I'm doing. With your square of paper, you're going to fold it lengthwise. And the other way. Oh my goodness. Smokey Joe. And the other way, I apologize for my rude kitty kitty. He likes to help. So now I have those four quadrants. What you're going to do is you're going to cut along these pre-folded lines. And you're going to cut towards the middle, but not all the way. Okay. I'm going to do that over here. Smokey Joe. Not all the way. And one more. Okay. All right. So now I have, my goodness gracious. Now what we're going to do is we're going to start folding our pinwheel towards the center. So you're going to take one corner of your triangle and you're going to take the same corner of all four of your triangles. Okay. And you're going to want it to be, you're going to want to just kind of hold them together, okay? But we're not going to tape them or anything. All right. There we go. Okay. And I know that's kind of hard to hold together, so maybe that's a part that mom or dad can help with, okay? So now I have all my, ooh, ooh, ooh. no, no, no. Okay. Now I have all my parts and pieces together. What I'm going to do with my pencil is the back of my pencil. This is the part that moms and dads have to help with. Okay, I have to take it through all the pieces. Let me put this down on the board so I don't hurt myself. Through the parts and pieces, through the paper, through everything. Oh my goodness. Oh, really? Okay, well, you know what? Try, try, try again. Miss Jennifer is going to try that again. Now I have all four corners all together. Let's see how my, my pen is coming out the back. See? Okay, now I can put it through the pencil. And then you just want to take it and pin it so that it goes into the pencil. This is definitely the part where your mom and dad have to help. Because we don't want anybody to get hurt. It has to go in, but not all the way. Oh my goodness, you're not going to work for me today, are you? Are you my craft? You know what? It is going to work for me today. I'm going to make this work. I'm going to do it in the eraser. Because if the wood is too hard for me to make it work, then I'm going to do it in the eraser. The eraser's not too hard to work. All right. My pinwheel is made. Let's see if it will turn. It turns a little bit. It turns. It turns. It probably just needs a little bit more wind than I'm able to create. But my pinwheel does work. And I have made a beautiful pinwheel using construction paper, a thumbtack, and a pencil. Oh, and of course scissors and a pesky cat too. So from Smokey Joe and Miss Jennifer, we ask that you stay happy, healthy, and make good choices. And we'll see you again soon. Bye-bye.